how we will use these guideposts as we go through the design to, to be successful. This is so the school really construction about. input team for okay. Mead Elementary School's Rebuild and Enlarge project. Do we want it so cool and trendy now because yeah. it's not going to be later? What, what we, we, in the concept design phase, ask the school to help us in terms of selecting a team that will be representative of the school to be able to help us to understand the vision of that school. Maintaining natural setting, natural light. It's been a wonderful opportunity hearing from professionals about things we could be thinking about um, as we formulate ideas about what would be great in a new school. To hear the different perspectives, both principal, teachers, other educators here, parent views, PTA, so many stakeholders, what is and isn't possible kind of coming out in these ideas. Great, so there's no wasted space back here, so really everything happens in the front. And it's been nice to see like our input come back at the next meeting and be heard and be seen and be the main focal point and seeing it all unfold. Mead Elementary is the smallest acreage buildable site that we have in the district and it's 3.9 acres, which means it's a very tight site to be able to do things. One of the things we've talked about is flexibility in the building, so ability to grow if needed in the future. This group was like a dream. They were very enthusiastic, they understood what we were trying to do in during these meetings. Uh, they learned a lot, they told us, as a response to the meetings that we had, and they helped us to craft the vision of who Mead Elementary is. Just look forward to a new building that will be safe and secure for our students and a great learning environment for all of our kids to be successful.